morning, so we're just getting ready to go get coffee, which I'm very excited about because, I don't know, I just want to get coffee out. And uh, then we have things to do today. Yeah. <laughs> so I learned the hard way last year after destroying my feet in Paris and London that I should probably get insoles. So guess what I did today? Insoles! What? <laughs> I love how the directions say, please read the directions, and all the directions say are, this is the left foot and this is the right foot. Like, really? It's like my pillows, my pillows, my feet have pillows now. Oh my goodness. Your pillows have feet. This is great. It's so foggy. I like it. Last time I was here, I haven't even been up there. So our first stop for this day was to go to the Museum of Pop Culture, otherwise known as Mopop, and it's a really neat museum. Um, the monorail passes right over it, and the Space Needle is right there if you want to check that out at the same time. It's a really cool museum, but obviously uh, it's pop culture, so there's a lot of super popular music playing inside, and uh, probably, most definitely, some, if not all of that, is copyrighted. So. Here you can enjoy the sights of the museum, but other than that, you're just going to hear some generic YouTube music over all of this. Oh, Elton John, I love you. And Jimi Hendrix.
So at this point in the video, there's not going to be any video because we went on uh, Bill Spidell's underground tour, which I highly recommend, but we could not take video down there because it would have been copyrighted. So here are some photos of the underground tunnels of Seattle. You'll hear more about this in my memory keeping plan with me later this week, but um, basically they're the Seattle burned down uh, at the end of the 19th century, as uh, many cities did, honestly. Um, but Seattle is kind of unique in that they decided to build on top of the rubble instead of like cutting it out or I don't know what you do after a fire. So there are these underground tunnels that were the first floors of buildings that you can go to. And then we went to a nice uh, Vietnamese restaurant near where we were staying and I got scallops and Nathan got a snail soup. They had a lot of snail stuff on their menu, which is really neat.